Okay, so I've got my packed monitor here and we're gonna go through assembling it. Of course, this comes with all the pre-packed peripherals in it. Take that piece of cardboard out. Take your bracket out, two pieces to it. This should just screw right in on the bottom here. Take all of our peripherals out here. Got your speaker. This is your bracket, your neck bracket that holds it up in case it gets a little too heavy. Sorry. Arrow pointing up. Okay. Power, your USB cable, the mouse, your display port cable, keyboard, put that aside. And lastly, your wires terminal and its power. Okay. Monitor's gonna have the wires terminal bracket pre-installed on it. recommend putting the cables on first. Make it a little easier on yourself. Again, we recommend putting the cables on first. Make it easier on yourself before you put the bracket in. So you got your power, USB, and your display port. Take out this extra display port stopper. Put that aside. Okay. Bracket on. And the bracket goes into these two holes up here. And then we're going to run the cables through the hole here. Eventually we'll tie these with Velcro, make them look a little bit neater. You go ahead and throw your, your wise terminal on the bracket here, it should just snap right in. Okay. We're gonna put our speaker on. Okay, so we're gonna take our USB cable and our display port cable, we're gonna kinda tie these up with Velcro. Plug them into our wise terminal here. Okay. We have our speaker on here. The speaker it just holds on one side and then expands on the other. So. Okay. And then you can adjust the height of it. And on the back of it. The speaker USB cable has to go into the, the bottom USB here on the monitor. Okay. Then we can go ahead and just roll this up as best we can just to get out of the way. You can take your thumb off too. Okay, so the last three items we have are the keyboard mouse and the wise terminal power. So we're just going to run the keyboard and the mouse through the hole. We did with all the other cables. So we're going to connect these to the um, side of the monitor here. Make sure you give the users enough length. Then we're going to take another piece of Velcro and just tie this up behind it just so it's nice and neat. 
But again, make sure the user has enough length so that they're not struggling to get their mouse, their keyboard to where they want it to be. Okay. And the last terminal power just goes right into the last terminal on the back here. Plugs in right to this side here. And of course, this will be plugged into the, the surge protector, whatever, whatever power you have available there. Um, we can go ahead and tie this up too in one of these ties if we have uh, room for it. And that's about all you should need for the installation.